Hey guys, it's Marcus here from TalkSober.com and today I got a really quick but really effective sobriety tip for you. And that is something that very few people realize. The fact that alcohol leaves your system usually in about three days to two weeks. Now, this is a dangerous part known as detox, and I highly recommend that you go to a doctor at least to get checked up and tell them what you're doing. But after those first two weeks, the alcohol leaves your system, and the cravings are all mental from that point on. So if you could get past that first two weeks, whether it's going to a doctor and detoxing or a rehab or a detox center or something like that, right? especially if you've been drinking a lot, you can actually get past that part where the physical symptoms, the physical withdrawal, the physical craving actually disappears. And then from that time on, it's all mental. And we can combat the mental one by realizing that it exists. Realize that it's just like OCD, right? Where you have to turn the key three times or you don't feel right about it. We can actually start to combat this by knowing that it's all in our mind. And if you focus on that and say, hey, it's just a mental thing. I don't actually need it then we could start to get better and we could start to heal. And once we realize this, we don't have to give into it anymore. We could realize, hey, that's just my mind telling me I need something that I don't really need. That's just my brain doing what it does because that was something that worked in the past, but it no longer works for you anymore. And you could start to get sober one day at a time just by realizing, hey, my mind is trying to make me drink and I don't have to do that anymore because I know the ultimate despair that drinking brings. I know what it feels like to wake up and have the guilt and the anxiety and the pain, and I don't want that anymore. So I'm not gonna listen to my mind anymore when it tells me that I need another drink. Because it's always that little insanity that gets you. It's that insanity of saying, I should be able to have one, I can have one, I want one. All those are things that are in your mind. And in a world where we look at things and say, hey, you know what? We don't need to listen to that anymore because we live in a world of possibility. We live in a world where your dream can come true and your life can be completely different. And this was something that was hard for me to come to grips with at first because I thought I mastered my mind. I thought I was the captain of my mind, but I realized that my mind had been tainted by the very thing I was using to cope with everyday life. And once you realize that, and you realize that alcohol has warped your mind, you can start to get better, and you don't have to listen to those thoughts anymore. Thanks again for watching. I'm Marcus from TalkSober.com. Make sure you subscribe if these are helping you out, and uh, watch my other videos. We're gonna help you get past this mental struggle, this mental craving that so many addicts deal with. So. Subscribe, click that little bell so you get notifications every time I come out with a new video. And feel free to join our community over at TalkSober.com. Thanks again for watching and I'll see you in the next video.